Good morning, morning, how are you doing? First, Melanie Smith felt sick, yeah, now it's her baby, okay. Kanisha. And she's had cold symptoms, fever, rash. The real worry, it's flu season. I think that she might have caught some of the symptoms that I had. <coughs> but spreading even faster this flu season, information in the form of an early warning system that's a potential lifesaver. When computer users look up words like thermometer or flu season, Google search engines track those searches automatically and anonymously. On its new site, anyone can see where searches are happening and how often, as one measure of where flu season is most worrisome. Before many families even call their doctor, they've researched with their fingers. A uh, hundred years ago, we did it with our feet. We walked to go find a doctor. Uh, now we use Google and other search engines. Over the last two years, Google's site tracked a spike in flu searches that was up to two weeks ahead of flu outbreaks, tracked by the Centers for Disease Control. CDC data requires that you get sick, visit your doctor, get tested, and have those test results reported. So it takes just a little bit longer. Lungs are clear, so there's no abnormal sounds. Little Kanisha has a virus, but she'll get a flu shot. We're encouraging parents get ahead of it. To stay ahead this flu season, even the CDC plans to check the Google site as a way of identifying hot spots before deciding where to ship vaccine. Mark Strassman, CBS News, Atlanta.